The goal has always been to make it to the playoffs and the finals. Two local teams have reached that goal. Both the Mad Ants and the Comets are one step closer to being champions. News Channel 15's Lamar Holiday joins us live from the Memorial Coliseum to break down the impact it's going to have on the Coliseum and the community. Lamar? Heather, the impact is simple. Basically, fans come out and see the games, and the money they spend on tickets, well, it's re reinvested back into the community. The Comets and Mad Ants, both teams are creating quite the buzz around town. That's because both are in the playoffs. We're in the event business and having our two major tenants both playing exceptionally well, it's a great start. Randy Brown is the executive vice president and general manager at the Memorial Coliseum. He claims this was quite a surprise. It's just a nice end of the year surprise and uh, again uh, to, uh, to look at the added ticket sales uh, for, the, for the clubs, it's uh, again, it's just uh, it, it shows the fruit of their hard work all season long. The result of their hard work pays off for the community and the Coliseum. According to Commons President Michael Franke, you can already see it taking place. When you have success with minor league sports, uh, you get things like the expansion of the Coliseum. You get things like the stadium downtown. The president of the Mad Ants, Jeff Potter, says it's all about giving back to the community. He says when you put out a competitive product, the people will come. That will in turn give the Mad Ants the chance to give back to the people who support the team. We want to do something great for the community and be a part of it and invest in it. And, uh, you know, that's all we've tried to do in the last eight years. This is how the teams play this week. The Comets will be out of town playing against the Kalamazoo Wings Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. The Mad Ants will take to the court this Thursday at the Coliseum. The time and team they'll be playing against is to be announced. We're live at the Coliseum, Lamar Holiday, News Channel 15.